Uh, well, here we go. Uh, I just came back from uh, Chesapeake, Virginia, where I was well, my residence in the United States. I'm in New York right now because I'm hanging with my fraternity brother, but I'm around the globe. Anyway, um, uh, since I'm spending this time out of South Africa, I figured, you know, since I was home or out of Chesapeake, then I might as well vote. So I voted yesterday. It was a Tuesday. It was like the last voting day for whatever have you, but it was a voting for Virginia, for in, in my area of Virginia. I forgot what congressional. I got it written down, whatever have you. So it was for Congress, and they had like two Republicans and two Democrats running for the Congress. And I think the, um, I see, I see, I voted for Chesapeake. Anyway. The woman's name, uh, Ella or something, so since I'm into Ella Baker, I figured, hey, I'll just vote for her. I didn't know, to, now I usually don't do this, I don't know too much about the voting down there. So uh, maybe in two years when I come back and I gotta vote again for Congress, then I'll research everybody, then I'll vote, you know, I'll really vote for my research rather than, you know, vote, you know, just vote, you know, like most people do. In fact, start talking about voting, let's think about it. I'm gonna say this maybe for the last time, hopefully. If you haven't gotten it yet, Donald Trump does not want to be president of the United States. He never wanted to be. It's just a whatever. No, no, but the point is, his, 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 it's like it's very interesting. He wins either way. If he becomes president, he's still the most famous person on the planet. If he doesn't become president, he still is the most famous person on the planet. He has a little leverage because he can get into all kinds of talk shows and stuff like that and talk to people and make well, speaking fees, whatever have you. So, you know, he's, he's like, he's sitting in that, what's called a cat bird seat and he's acting like a cat. He's eating a lot of these birds so I just wanted to say that about that uh, anyway so just just remember that when you go out and vote forget this thing about being uh, how do you say this for being uh, you know scared people vote out of fear whatever have you you can vote your conscience they, believe me no one's gonna let even if they do like I said he wins either way but even if they like to vote your conscience you know don't vote for a chicken hawk or vote for what you think is gonna be progress because you ain't never had no progress because like they say the Anglo the, the Anglo <laughs> white supremacist racist white supremacist are still in charge they're gonna be in charge until you start doing something but I did have an idea I did have an idea because of all the sh shootings that happened in Orlando and stuff like that. It's interesting because a sister was trapped in the bathroom with some other folks. They keep on saying it's a gay club. Sure, it's a gay themed club. But you understand, this is dance music, so anybody can come into that club. You understand that that is sure it's gay dominance. It's like it's like like the, the they, it's like the shelter, the shelter in New York. You know, my club. You know, not to be gay, but you know, it's that's where the the the, the good dancing goes. Anyway.